Time now for a check on our weather. Meteorologist Tony Sadiku is back with your first alert forecast. Tony, such a nice day today. Amazing. Really nice. And the best part, Jessica, is when the best weather lines up with our weekend. I know, right? And that's exactly what we've got. And I think that's what we retain into tomorrow, too. So weather is in good shape for the most part. Just a minor hiccup here with the air quality. It's up to the moderate category. It's not really that high, but did want to let you know. Not affiliated with the wildfires out west, but there are other wildfires up north that are sending us some of the hazy skies that we've got in place today. But other than that, can't beat this. Temperatures on their way down from the upper 80s. We've got low 80s out the door right now. 82 in the city, 83 wide plain. Still pretty toasty in Bridgewater, 87. But this is what sweetens the deal. Dew points, nice and comfy in the 50s. It's a long way from what we had just a couple of days ago. When these numbers were in the 70s. Enjoy this because it's not sticking long but anything you're doing outdoors this evening where you're dining outside taking the pub for a walk it's all good skies will clear temperatures will fall there is no rain to talk about at least for now but i mentioned the dew points will be climbing so tomorrow it's still in check the humidity starts to come back you will notice it returning by monday even more so and up we go tuesday and wednesday that is going to be a part of the story in the next week as well as increasing rain chances we still have high pressure in charge tomorrow but we've got a watch this guy area low pressure to the south it's going to make an interesting move high pressure retreats this low is going to kind of backtrack in our direction and we'll be in the outer fringes of its influence we think tomorrow so some of the clouds will start to move in and then eventually a couple drops of rain so we'll take you on future cast into tonight notice we're all good we wake up to clear skies an amazing morning if sunday's run day enjoyed whether you're planning maybe a picnic running errands weather's not going to get in the way but you will notice by afternoon clouds Clouds are starting to thicken from the east. Everything moves east to west. It's still brighter the further west you go. Notice it's still dry. But the later we go in time, the better chance some of that moisture from that pesky low will start to trickle into some of our eastern zones. And don't be surprised you get a shower. Better chance overnight. Some of this could lead to perhaps some wet weather, isolated, not widespread, to spotty on that Monday morning commute. And then as the system kind of moves to the north, that may put the bullseye the best rain chance so our northern community so you'll see how the rain totals play out not a big number here but parts of connecticut maybe parts of dutchess putnam county you could amount a little bit more otherwise we will expect rain chances to eventually start to climb tuesday and wednesday especially as our pattern gets uh, back to familiar range basically what we saw a good portion of last week with daily rain chances and then eventually the 90s could make a comeback jessica 90s i, I like i prefer this this is like the perfect Perfect happy medium, you right? Just gotta enjoy while we got it. I know, that's right. <laughs> it, it's the sort of the summer roller coaster that we, we take the good with the bad, mm -hmm. right? All right, thank you so much, Tony. Nice to have you here with us tonight.